Okay, I've been cruising the floor, AHR 25. So massive, it blows your mind being here at the AHR. Uh, how's it been out here? It has been busy. Yeah. Uh, my my throat is dry. I can't drink enough water. Oh man! And uh, there's just a lot of people excited at the trade show. What I'm really excited about sharing today is the new product here that we're going to unveil for HVAC School. Woo. There we are. <laughs> yeah. So we have Cincy EIM. So where has this product been our entire lives? That's yeah. You know I. I <laughs> I ask that all the time as a former contractor. I've been around dehumidification for a long time, Nancy. Yep. This does not look like what I know. Nope. What do we got going on here? Right. So desiccant's desiccant. Still a great thing. It does a great job, but it doesn't always have to be in the solid form. So okay. it's in a liquid form. We got a liquid desiccant going on when here. When it's in a liquid form, you can do different things with it. So one of the products that I'd like to highlight today happens to be our hub series. What's really neat about this hub system is the fact that our wireless gauge sets actually have a 180 degree swivel on them. Yes, this is our new vapor injection variable speed product. Um, it has a Y, we call it the YAW, and it has a product range going from two ton all the way up to 25 ton. 25 ton, wow. Yes. What I'm standing in front here is really a wall that's highlighting today uh, our low GWP solutions. So we're spending a lot of time, energy on that low GWP transition. The, the E2 controller is kind of known as the one to compare everybody else to. It's one of our favorite controllers. It's been around for so long and it's just so rock solid. What is Copeland doing with the E2? We're progressing, we're moving on, uh, moving to the E3 controller. So a little bit of comparison to the E3 to E2 to make sure that that, that our installers, the contractors and end users that get familiar going from E2 to E3. We kept a lot of features from that E2 into the E3. Just, just to make that transition a little easier in the field if you're going from an E2 to an E3 retrofit. I am here with Cool Automation at AHR Expo 2025, and I want to talk to David here about the controllers that Cool Automation offers. At a most basic form, we are a universal VRF central controller, right? We got connectivity into any brand and any manufacturer of VRF. That's really where our bread and butter is. Uh, we've been in the industry for 15 years as a, as a communication solution for VRF systems. Today we're talking some revolutionary products here with Hisense. This is Steve with Hisense. One machine is providing the comfort heating and cooling for your home. Yes. And it will the, also produce the hot water. The byproduct is hot water. This is our new uh, R32 top discharge VRF unit. This is our three phase. This machine will do heat recovery and heat pump. Uh, okay. If you're familiar with the, the difference between there. All right, so one of the things that NAVAC is really known for, and we've talked about this over the years, uh, are their recovery machines. This new NP series of uh, pumps really ups the game again. Uh, it has a oil test mode so that you can actually test your oil right on board with the onboard gauge. It runs a one minute test and it gives you a pass or fail result. And then you've got the entire wall of kind of additional small tools that NAVAC has, everything from, uh, I really like their deburring tool. NAVAC is, having innovation after innovation coming out in our trade, everything from vacuum to recovery machines to working tubing. Um, again and again, they keep coming out with really great stuff. I love the fact that we've got a, a very large, you know, new generation coming through. Yes. It seems like there's a heck of a lot more interest in it. Um, and I mean, I like, I, I think it's an exciting time for them to become part of HVAC yep. because I mean, look around you. Oh yeah, The amount huge. of tools and stuff available now? It's Jeez. amazing, it's amazing. <laughs> no, I've been doing this for a long time, and yeah. to see what's out there now, it almost makes me feel like, man, you guys yeah. got it easy. It was stone chisel, and, you know, <laughs> uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. If you're willing, give this video a thumbs up and drop us a comment. Don't forget to hit that bell icon to stay updated with all of our future videos.
And as a quick reminder, HVAC School isn't just a YouTube channel. Dive deeper with us at our main website, HVACRschool.com. Curious for more knowledge on the go? We've got you covered. Tune into the HVAC School podcast, available on all your favorite podcast apps. And while you're at it, join our thriving Facebook group. Also, don't miss out on our free mobile applications available for both iPhone and Android. We're all about community. Vortex by Tex.